Merry Christmas, you filthy animals. It is the Richmond Gooners podcast here on Boxing Day, the resumption of the league campaign, Match Day 15. It is, uh, we're here at Gus's Bar and Grill as always. I am Ryan here with Tom. All right now. And with Joey. Big Bong. And with Will. Here in Fleur. Happy birthday, Lars Ulrich. Oh, well, there you go. It's um, my birthday. Was invited also, to the podcast. <laughs> also, shout out, shout out to the staff here at Gus's for putting up with yes. us. Yes, yeah. Some of these, some of these motherfuckers have been here since they opened at ten, yeah. and we're still keeping them here. So, props to them. Uh, before we start on a on a technical note, I would like to uh, fess up to the fact that I have recently discovered that, despite myself muting myself every time I belched on this podcast. Turns out it only goes to the stereo mix that way and not the multi-track. So for all y'all who think I'm so, disgusting, so everyone hang hears on, it. Hang on. For all y'all who think I'm <laughs> disgusting, A, you are correct, and B, I'm also an idiot and don't know how to work my own gear. So there you go. Vindication! Yeah, yeah. yeah well, this is what happens by lazy mixing and just throwing a limit See, on the thing. Like, I don't the thing. Hear all if you that. just do what I do, you never get hurt. Well, no, and now I'm going to turn my head. So there, <laughs> and there goes Tom. So thank you for that. I appreciate the support. And so there we are. All right. Now on to the business. So wait till I make my booty hole sing. Uh, that's that's yeah. We'll all, we'll all smell it before anyone sees it. So <laughs> match day. I guess it's technically seventeen, but it's fifteen. 17, so it's, yeah. Thanks, Queenie. Um, home to West Ham. 15. Restarted the campaign. Where were we at the at the start of the week, gentlemen? Top Five. of the table. Top of the league. Where top do we league. end Five, at the, the top, top of the table? Of the there you go. So hey, there guess you go. what? We could have said that before the game even happened, because no matter what the fuck happened today, right, we're we still, were still the in the yes. in the match week at top of the league. Mm. Yes, as but we have so just, many match weeks. It just feels good to say. It feels so yeah. good to say. Yeah, and even yeah. though City hasn't played, and even though it's early in the in the year, it, it doesn't matter. It don't still we're still top of the league. Yeah, I wouldn't even call it early. Well, I mean, it's early because we didn't play as many games as you normally would have it, by this, this point. This is true. This because is true. of the World Cup. So, so it's, 23 you know, games. I, I would say, so by this time, Third we would normally through. have pay, played 18 or 19 games. And now we've yeah. played 15. 15. Yeah. Yep. Yeah, 15. Yeah, we're 13, yeah. 13 one, one and one. one. Yeah, yeah 15, 15, this was 15. Yeah. yeah. We talking about three games. We well, talking about three games. <laughs> yeah, but like if one I of those games was a franchise player. <laughs> but one of those games is supposed to be against City and we haven't played it yet. Correct. So those kind of things Correct. matter. But, and um, that's an know, important one. That's important. It's an important one. So coming into the, you know, starting today, you look at the lineup and it's pretty much what you expect. Though Tierney gets the start, which, you know, I think at least one of us is very excited yeah. about. Well, so Joey yeah, and I course. even talked about that too. It was actually, even though Zinchenko we know was coming back from a slight injury, yeah, yeah. things like that. It was actually the 100% correct move because, because of, of because of who their right wing is. Yeah. Yeah. We needed Joe, a fast Joe Bowen. defender. Defender, yeah, right. Because and he I mean, got back on on on, on counters yeah. on a couple occasions yep. like and that. He, he he pocketed Jared Bowen for the most part today. He did. He did. And and it was we needed his sort of athleticism. Whereas Zinchenko is maybe a more technical player. Uh, Tierney has that raw athleticism. Yeah, you, you can't deny that. The course. second half, he had a sprint that he pulled out. That I think we forget about sometimes that how fast, fucking fast yeah. he is. Right, one on one, you put a ball into a corner, and then it's. Up to him and the winger who gets there first. And yep. yeah. he has some speed people forget about. Yeah. You know, okay, like speed is always you think about Salah or Treore yep. or you know, there's some absolute pace merchants out there, but Tierney he's, he's one of them. If I, I'm pretty sure I'm pretty sure this season so far, for our team specifically, he's been clocked as the second fastest so yes. far in game. Martinelli has has had Martinelli, the fastest yeah. run. And Martinelli has uh, that superhero speed where when he gets the yeah. ball at his feet, he's even faster. He's faster, yeah. yeah. It's like him and ESR both have that. Yeah. Twice in the first half, he was going, uh, the ball was like a 50-50, and then I was like, as soon as he collects that ball, man, he just, it's just like you press the red button and He's gone. Yeah, you can't Mo, get Sal- him. Mo Salah can't has get that him. too. Yep. Mo Salah had a run earlier yeah. today in their game that he just he got that ball on that counter yeah. and just gone. And both those guys, Martinelli and Salah, mm. both those guys have elite close control at full pace. Yep. Yep. And it's like the ball's glued mm. to their feet and they're running as as yep. fast as you know anybody that you see. So. The b- b- both very good, it's, and you know what? It's nice. It's nice that we're talking about these two players in the same breath. Yeah, one hundred percent. Yeah, you know what I mean. So we got punched in the face first. Yeah, yeah, we did. After having a goal disallowed. If the, yeah, oh, after yeah, having okay, a goal yeah, disallowed. I forgot Spirit about that. Of the so the punch in the face was like half half West Ham, but half <laughs> Michael fucking Oliver. Ryan, that was disgusting. With, uh, yeah, Ryan, come on, man. No, ain't nobody. No, <laughs> Michael Oliver. I'll, I'll do some. I'll do some funny editing to make it look like Ryan did that on the video. <laughs> um, uh, How dare that? Was that onion? <laughs> oh, <laughs> y'all, y'all gotta know. No, what it, it was just ass. Is oh, that onion, onion or asshole? 
Okay, for which it, has a stronger. We're gonna throw aroma. up a Twitter poll. Which which tastes better, <laughs> Absolutely. onion Will, or Will, ass? Will, can you throw that up, please? Nope. Can, can you throw that up? Nope. Joey, hey, I'll, I'll do it. it. I'll do it. <laughs> Joey, put it, put that shit up there. I'll which would you rather eat, I'll onion do right or now. asshole? And I'll let's see right what now. happens. This this is gonna be a Not scientific experiment. Not on the RG account. Yes, 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 yes on the RG account. Okay, someone's got to temporarily change the profile picture that our seniors podcast. My name is Tom Sevens, and I did not authorize this post. My name is Joey Christian, and I approve this message. Yes. Oh, good. <laughs> Vote for me for president of the Ass Eaters Council. Yeah. Um, so, anyway, uh, well, and the, the other thing about Tyrion, kind of like to kind of close the book on him, like, there was a lot of times, like, it was almost like he was just running fucking sprints up and down, waiting yeah. for the ball. Like, he had the opportunity to make even more of an impact and just never was served the ball. It a looked times. bizarre because yeah. there were a few times that I thought Partey could have given him the ball and, and, chose to not do that. Yeah. And I think part of that is just yeah. the way that we've played without him. They've kind of like not been looking for that scorching run on the left yeah, wing. I, I think part uh, of it well, he, Yes, no. that's right. That is, is, is right. Is that motherfucker here? No, no, who, no, Chip? No, no, who, who did this? Who, who, wait, who's here? Uh, to use one of my favorite quotes of all time, Ryan. Chip, are you here? You may very well think that, but I couldn't possibly comment. Uh, who did this? I don't know. <laughs> for those of you not watching on News Channel 8, we were just handed four shots of Jaeger oh, for some fucking give, reason. Give, my, give mine to Shane. Give mine to Shane. Oh, Jesus. Give yours to Shane. Yeah. I, I don't, you guys you, know I don't drink that much. Appreciate it, Trey. You guys I, know I don't drink that much. All right. But, uh, so here's the poll. Katie, Stop who, being who a bitch and come on. Who, who's, who's at fault for this? It was me. It was me. It was me. All right. Let's go. All right, I just uh, had a place of love to Arsenal Merry and Christmas, to eating ass. Cheers. Yes. And Happy holidays, everybody. Bing bong. Someone always have to go to work tomorrow. Bing bong. <sighs> Fuck your life. Yep. Bing bong. Yep. Yep. Uh, Here's what the poll says. Which after eating? Will, did you do yours? Yes, he did. Uh, my man. My man. Did. Let's go. <laughs> my man. Well, well I hate it. for the camera, he kind of did it. Well, he did like not 90% it. of it. You can finish that. He'll, He'll, finish it. He'll get to it. You or Joey will. Okay. Crawl before you walk. Get this shit out of here. I don't want to smell All right, that so shit. here's what the poll says. I which, do not drink. Which, after eaten, has the strongest aroma on the breath? <laughs> after <laughs> onions. That's not fair. And no, that tweet. is fair. That's exactly the point that we were having before we started recording. Well, but, but, but one, you, <laughs> one you actually consume, one you don't. Like, of course onions are going to smell more after because you, you actually eat both If them. you have children, this Do is the time eat? to turn off the podcast. Do you I think, 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 the, the, I think the universe might off. be telling you something because the internet... Oh, no, never mind. It's up. It's up. Was Twitter like, are you sure it's you want to ask this <laughs> question? Yeah, 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 exactly. <laughs> 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 All right, so that uh, that's happening. Yeah. Um, but there's a woman out there that's thinking, I don't like that being done to me. Think about it this way. It means he really likes you. He really likes you. Anyway. Uh, so here's here's where I'm gonna hop off the train. Uh, <laughs> if you don't want me to do it to you, I'm not gonna do it to you. <laughs> Full stop. <laughs> All right. Yep. All so right. I, I might present back. I might present arguments every now and then, but <laughs> you might be like, "Hey, have you thought about?" Okay, yeah. fine. I'm I, might, saying, I, might do, I might do a PowerPoint presentation <laughs> once a month. Uh, Look, I'm just saying. So, uh, thank you for coming to my dinner. However, here are the merits. Yeah, yeah. I'm just saying if, if, we're, if we're in Ryan's basement after a Christmas party, and it happens, and it just. For the record, my house has a crawl space, which is where ass eating should happen. If, if only cut, we got cut, you the cut, house cut, with the crazy cut, basement. Dude, I want cut, man, cut, 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 it would have been, cut, cut, been cut, so good. It would have been so good with that basement house. Oh. Although, like now that I think about it, it like trying to clean that you. fucking it place. Means he likes you. So, and if, so and if many square feet to keep to upkeep. And, yes. if, and if your but man doesn't, the do basement that, studio would have far outpaced the family room studio. But anyway, but I like the current studio. Back to Arsenal Football Club. We digress. Back to us, who the who the fuck is at the top of the table? That means yeah, right. Right. Oh, I, I got some shit to say. Who the fuck's at the top of the table? For all those people in the Twitter sphere, people that have told me personally that we're gonna falter uh, as soon as we get back the from, the, from the from the break. We're gonna, oh, oh, and now Chase Hoos, your West Ham's gonna beat you guys. The proof is in the pudding, my fucking 66. friends. And the pudding is delicious. The proof is in the pudding. They say because 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 Gabriel Jesus is there is not here. You know, we're going to falter. We don't have him. Not realizing that we have arguably the best right back in England. We have arguably yeah. the left best left back in England. And if you're talking about who's a better center back pairing other than Saliba and Gabriel, you better come with a resume. Yeah. Or yeah. whatever, some sort of supporting argument. 
We have one of the tightest back fours right now. We're, we still have the best defense in the league as well. Yes. Even after giving up a goal today, I'm, so I'm pretty it's, sure. Yeah, we have the best we can choose to become the right immovable winger. object or the unstoppable force. We may not be the unstoppable yeah. force right now, but we are definitely the immovable object. object. Yeah. Ooh, okay, okay, okay. Joe See Perry says bye. <laughs> but, right. yeah, I mean... Like, Later, man. Joe Perry, can I get an Perry. autograph? Sixty-six percent. <laughs> Steve Bannon, sixty-six <laughs> percent. We got, we got, we got Joe Perry, yeah. and we got Dale Steve Hartburn Perry. Jr. Dale Harper Jr. Yeah. 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 All right, <laughs> Steve Bannon. All right, now. See you, Teasley. Early leads. Sixty-six. Um, yeah, well, and like possession. you look, like Ben Five White today. Down. There was that that on the last goal, Ben White just ended a motherfucker's Come back after career. He passes yes. out. Yes. yes, you know, like he yeah. that that just like little like little chop over the guy. Oh yeah, the, the, yeah, that. Yeah, that, yeah like yeah. It, 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 you know, and like no no backliner should be doing I, that. I hope that wasn't also Ben Rama because he got he got Ben Rama with a chop that no one in the universe expected him to do. Ben, you just see Ben Rama just go swoop, just sliding yeah. by on the ground. Ben White just. Just it was like Ronaldo, like he just chops it back. Speaking and puts, of puts making the people slide by twice today, number one, Ben White, when he did that Cruyff turn, yeah, that's yeah. what we were talking yeah. about. Yeah. Okay, yeah. and then and then Mo, Martin Odegaard oh, when God. he did that left hand, he had two people on him. <laughs> that he he nutmeg Paqueta behind his leg, behind his standing leg. I was like, oh, he needs to take some time off from the game. <laughs> yeah, he needs to take he, uh, his life. Choices. Give him a month. He needs to he potentially remember retire. Top going, he's like because Paqueta's a hell of a player too. I'm gonna, hit, I'm gonna hit the air brakes and he's gonna go right by me. Right. Well, and. Uh, Odegaard, and that's who's on this jersey. Um, and his, that's a kid his shirt, my man. His don't his, be so American. Huh. <laughs> nah, the kit is the full kit. That's a kit shirt. All right, I'll give that to you. Who's it? Who's that's what that's right. Semantics. But Who, either way, was he our best player? One hundred percent. Yeah, he Odegaard. was. He was Odegaard? Odegaard. Yeah, 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 yeah. Man of the match for me. Yeah, yeah. Two assists. He, he, he had two every, assists. everything I mean, you want. Just absolute puppet master. Today. Silky. Just, yeah. Dribble that first assist to Saka. Oh my god. So you know and you know oh what? The 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 Dubai trip, uh the friendly games, yeah. he played in all of them. Yeah, he did. So he's still he's still mm-hmm. you know mm-hmm. at, he's at, fresh. At match so there's yeah. match fitness and there's match sharpness. His sharpness yeah. as, as FIFA yeah. would teach yeah. us now His with sharpness new, is as yeah. sharp the as ratings. it can be. Yeah. Well, and he and he looked he looked up for it from minute 1. Mm-hmm. Well and as and Rob wanted me to point this out on on the show he mentioned it like Saka was fresher later in the game mm. than he has been in a long time yeah. and part of that is because the other team decided to beat the shit out of Martinelli instead yes. of him yes. <laughs> but and, and Tierney like, and Tierney yeah. but like Tierney, 70th geez. minute Saka is still running down yep. pressuring the keeper Eddie you know, was too Eddie was and Eddie too, was too. Yeah. so like and I, I don't know how much of that is the break or just not being beat to shit for right. once but you know like that's another level of something that we can it's look gotta be a to, weird hopefully. feeling that you allow other players to take the beating, and it's just like a thanks, guys. You know, like I got it. Yeah, like, thanks, like thanks I'll for, take it from for, here. Yeah, I'll thanks for it. taking the heat so that I don't have to get my ass kicked today. Right and now, and, I'll and, take and it. what do you know? He produced. Well, like that's, that's not, it's not like soccer shows. That, like the other team, just, uh, West yeah. Ham decided to take Martinelli yeah. out of the game. Yeah, they they try and and by the way, but, but he you, can, didn't you can't get taken take them the both out of the game. Yeah. Well, no. and if you take one out of the game, the other's probably going to. All I'm saying is, and they both scored, even though they tried to take Martinelli. He still got his goal. Let me put this way. West Ham's, West Ham, their strategy today was to double team Martinelli and Odegaard. They yes. they failed miserably. Yep. They, they had Declan well, right, the, they had Declan the first, shadowing Odegaard. For most of the first half, it worked out okay. Did it? Because we still had plenty of chances. We created chances. We still had plenty of possession. 66% for the whole game. We doubled their well, okay, but how many, how many when you score, when you score three goals and not score. I mean, yeah. but, but when you score right. when you score three goals and the three goal scores are, is everyone in your front line. Yeah. yeah. That means you did what you were supposed yeah. to yeah, do. We, we did. Under, under and, a tactical and, set like yeah. our 10 had two assists. Yeah. 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 No, it, it took a minute to get everything going. Yeah. But once we did, okay, I'll, then it was over. Yeah. I'll give you no, that. It, it worked for a while. It took us a minute to figure it out, but like that's that's what happens when a team is to, from my perspective, I mean, like when the team is deciding like we're going to shut X, Y, and Z down, sure. it's going to take you a little longer to get going yeah. under that situation as opposed to like a team, a game where okay, two that's guys, a good point. where that's two teams point. are just like openly attacking. I mean, that's a good like, point. It wasn't, like a, it wasn't the full yeah, part yeah, yeah. of the bus, but it was close. Yeah, it's fair. Arteta's teams have, I would say, considerably better adaptability yeah. than than Wenger's teams. Uh, yes. Uh, yeah. Cuz uh, Wenger was so well, he was determined like, not to like adapt. Yeah. yeah. He was somewhat like Pep in that we have our plan A and, and if it doesn't work we we, we, just we don't have any, we don't yeah. have anything else. Yes. We'll just yeah. do plan A harder is what Yeah, exactly. Plan is. So exactly. I, I would I would argue that this game was legitimately the best performance from our entire front four that we've seen this season. 
Hmm. All together? All well, together, it's, well, All together it's as first, a whole four. It's the first time that we've seen this front four get this much with, on field time. Oh, with Eddie. I know. I know. With Eddie, yes. But, like, but like whoever the number nine may be. Yeah. 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 Because, I mean, all three of our attackers scored. Yeah. Odegaard absolutely controlled the game, 100%. Had no issues whatsoever. And Our, our entire midfield was so oh, yeah. excellent. Yeah, yeah. 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 I mean, everyone was excellent. Yeah. Even Saliba's penalty was bullshit. Um, oh, that's yeah. the softest yeah. fucking hours, hours, like, hours being yeah. disallowed. Our goal being disallowed. Yeah, the fact that, like, yeah. look, the spirit like, it's, of the the Mi- it's the Michael Oliver effect. Yeah. Other teams get better benefits of the doubt, and Arsenal gets Ryan, more benefits of the like booty hole. <laughs> oh, my God. No, We're not you, getting yeah, off track no. here. But that's the thing. It's just Ryan, like, for God's sakes, control yourself. Yeah, you look, you look at, like, I mean, like, admittedly. I was going to attach your name to that booty hole smell, but no. Oh, don't, do <laughs> don't do it. Don't do it. Don't do it. Don't Don't make me add it. I'm so tired already. Booty hole. I'm so tired already. <laughs> yep. All right. So no, like the fact that like the fact that they I reviewed, thought Josie fired her. <sighs> oh, the fact that they reviewed one penalty and not the other is bizarre, and the fact yeah. that like yeah. very clearly like. I Whoever just, was in the booth one and one thing and said, no, you look at right. each side of the well, other. Right. Yeah. And ours I, are just like, eh, it's fine. You know? I just, I just, and, and, and I did say this to you live. Yeah. When, when they gave the, when Michael Oliver gave the penalty for the Saliba challenge, and I, we knew VAR was going to look at it, right? And when we saw it, you know, yes, we all agree it was soft, but I immediately turned to him and said, they're going to keep it the same. Yeah. They're just yeah. going to say, because mm-hmm. there is contact, they're just going to fucking Because there was it. Th- this much contact. And I yeah. looked at Rob, who was looking back at but you, like, and I said, Rob, there was this much contact. That's but here's I'm. something, right? Like, did so, so in the Liverpool game, I think it was a Liverpool game. Maybe it wasn't, but either way, there was a game earlier today. Mike Dean was the VAR official. No, that was the um, that was the game with the red cards. That was um, uh, Crystal um, Palace. Palace. Yeah. yeah. So so Mike Dean calls over the referee about a call to say you need to take a look at this. Yeah, it was after the uh, second goal yeah. where Mitrovic headed the ball yeah, yeah. and it looked like it hit his arm, but it might have hit the it defender first. It was the handball thing. Yeah. 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 And and Mike Dean said, "Hey, come take a look at this because there's a potential handball." And clearly. Clearly in the headset, as the referee's watching it, He's Mike, Dean, Mike Dean is flat out saying, this is handball, no goal. And the ref, and the ref said, says, no, nope. nah, I'm keeping it. And and so he went to the he went to the screen yeah. and he came back out and he said, it's a goal. Yeah. And like, it was, wow. like, I agree with it. Because it, it's who was, just. Who was, the, who was the referee? I can't remember. I can't I remember. remember but, but what I'm getting at is, to go back, because you brought it up now twice and we, we haven't touched on it yet. But the our first goal, the offside, the spirit of the fucking game, dude. Like. Saka had no intention to play that he ball. He was looking whatsoever. the other way. The ball happened to touch. It literally flicked his foot. It, yeah. it happened to do yeah. this. Not, to his foot, not like. a single, not a single West Ham player was like, "Oh, this is offside," well, or, or was preparing for yeah. his eventual touch of the ball. Right. right. He was. He was. Really, well, he touched the ball because he was literally trying to run the other way to make a run yep. to make the secondary run. And and yet and yet, VAR they look at it and they're like, "Oh yeah, that's a good call." And it's like, "Come on, man." Garbage. Come on, but it's, it's almost like they want to basura. give it merit because it it, it fucking disrupts. Yeah, they want to disrupt. Also, yeah, and also well, if, if the they're going to disrupt the game, they want to make it mean something. Well, yeah, here's yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. here's want to be a waste of time. I, I hear you. I hear and, you. And here's my other thing you. too. How in the fuck did that AR see that little flick? Yes, there's exactly. No way. There's no How way. the fuck? The Zapruder film was fucking he, bullshit. Yeah, he yeah, called yeah. it on the field. It's fucking bullshit. He called it on the field. Like, bro, the ball and his foot. This is the ball. This is his foot. You cannot see the contact. Yeah. One one ball molecule touched one boot yeah. molecule, yeah. and yeah. he's like, and "Oh, this yeah, I, like, saw I that. got it." No, you I fucking got it. didn't, my guy. <laughs> yeah, the, no. cam- the cameras right now don't have the accuracy. Lie to of- Jesus, son. Don't lie to me. Yeah. <laughs> well, even, even if the cameras do, the people sure as shit don't to call it in the first place. Right. But you know? but anyway, getting back to it though is that Saliba <laughs> penalty, right? Like VAR is like looking at it, and just send it's Michael. So just send him to the box. Just say, hey, just. Look at it. Like we agree with you on. We're gonna. We're, we're saying let's lean to keep your call on the field the same. However, but at least have a look. But at least have a look and see if you, when you see it the second time, do you think that that contact actually had a distinct change in that player? Because there was no distinct difference between that player. Here's yeah. my thing, and here's what bo- what can often bother me about VAR. Thank you. If if. Lift your fork if to VAR, the plate, your if VAR to the was reviewing, if he had not made the on-field call as penalty, if he you know waved it off right. on field, right, uh, and he got the shot off, and it, or, or, or no matter what, if you waved it off on field, and then VAR, and then they review it, 
they don't give that. One hundred percent. They don't give it. They, whatever. That's, whatever. That's my yeah. issue. I'm, it's that, one of those I'm, I'm, they're just yeah. keeping it to whatever. I'm, I'm he has. almost one hundred percent positive they don't give that. Yeah. If he waved it off, yeah. and then, then they looked at it, they yeah. won't give it because it's yeah. not. It's too soft. It was, it yeah. was, and that but, was. And, but yeah. if he if he called it on field, they're and then there was this much contact. Oh, see, and so and so there's not quote unquote irrefutable proof that. Michael Oliver made a mistake. Correct. There is proof that this is a soft penalty that he w- that I would normally give. Yeah, but it's, but not, it's not a quote a unquote mistake. mistake. Correct. That to me is the heart of what is wrong with clear the and yeah. obvious error. Yeah. And there was no clear and obvious error because right. of the fact that there was contact. There was however, a tiny, tiny bit of contact. However, we have seen already since VAR has come into this league, we have seen VAR take those and. Negate it. Yeah. Right. And, it, and I mean, I've seen Raheem Sterling be offside by an armpit hair like three times. Right. Now. Yeah. Right. Yeah. yeah, yeah. I, I don't. I don't. All anybody wants is well, consistency. We don't get that anymore. The way once, yeah. once they change their offside lines, the, this year the offside calls with VAR have actually been dead on. Accurate. Okay. Good. So, got, is it the same semi-automatic shit they're using at the World Cup? Or no, it's but they like. It, it's gonna sound like the a joke 3D here. rendering shit. It, yeah, mm-hmm. yeah. It's gonna sound like a joke here, but they went with thicker lines. Yeah, and mm. and basically we've, we've got, got super thick, thick Arteta. <laughs> he knows exactly <laughs> what we did. <laughs> Ryan and I just looked at yeah. each other, and we yeah. both knew this what is how both was about to happen. Yeah. But but they use those thicker lines. Shout out to Lauren Ginsburg. They basically yeah. are using those thicker lines because they realize that like, oh, the the fingernail is just ridiculous. Yeah, right. Because someone so, make up a yeah. song to thicker lines. So they are they Instead are of Robin Thick. <laughs> I, I will admit I will admit thick that they're lines. Yeah. I know you want them. Hit. So <laughs> I, I will not, admit they, we got to workshop it. They <laughs> are they are yeah. applying. It's the a first spirit. pass. Yeah. They, they aren't all winners. They are applying the spirit of the law. In that regard, right, much better now. Yeah, um, yeah, I agree. You know, but there's still something. I feel like two years ago, I feel like I hear like spirit of the law oh, whenever somebody commits manslaughter. Horrible. Like, well, they were applying the spirit of the law yeah. when they beat those Negroes to death. It was, <laughs> oh my god, it was <laughs> landowners <laughs> meant to. That's uh, some fucking Jim Jim Crow shit right <laughs> there. Oh my god, all that shit. Oh and I just spent I just spent a weekend in Luray. L- yeah, which land you know, of, land of such. Listen, listen, I and and listen, my wife's family is absolutely lovely, and I love going up there and spending time with them. But when I encounter strangers in Lorraine, yeah, you didn't go to the best part of there again, did I'm you? Get around the store the whole <laughs> time. Right, your right, no, hand, no, no. Your right so hand got a little uneasy. What happened that time was so <laughs> there is no Best Buy in Lorraine. Sometimes if we stay for like a couple days after Christmas, obviously today is Boxing Day, so and I wanted to get back here for the game. Yeah. Uh, also, we did we did we did our annual thing where we gather money and give it to Gus's staff. We gathered the most we've ever ever gathered in our 11 year history this year. So shout out to all fucking, who fucking yes, awesome. And, you, and again, shout out to Gus's staff. But we need that, a clap audio. Track. That time, yeah, we did. That time, I, I, well, we, all we can, I've got is ping pong. Oh, oh, that works. Listen, we can add it. We can add it in post. Um, but Hercules, that time, Hercules. what happened is we stayed. We stayed like a couple days after Christmas, and um, yeah. or no, no, this is after Thanksgiving. Yeah. it was Black Friday actually, and so it, Why if, is you, it if you want if you want to go to any <laughs> store, do you want to know? You probably know the answer to that. You know, know the answer to that? What Walmart? No. No, why it's called Black Friday? Oh, no, I just, no, I just, no, it's called it's called Black Friday because you run your sales and you get so much business. Yeah, you get into oh, the black. Yeah, in the black. yeah, yeah that's yeah, the yeah, point that's of the year where you go from being in the red to in the black. black yeah. uh, financially. That's fucking awful. Um, yeah, yeah, yeah. It's like a, it's like a desperation thing. It, I, I would guess that, like you're in the black, like yeah. in accounting I, terms. I'd always be interested. Yeah. Yeah, it is. I'd always be interested to know how much money. It's funny how in accounting terms black is good, but everywhere else black is bad. Speaking of, so what happened in Lorraine on Black Friday a few years back was if. If you want to go to any store, not Walmart or Food Line, you have to go to Harrisonburg from yeah. Murray, which yeah. is like you know half an hour yeah. or so ish, if that. Um, so we were in Harrisonburg at, at the Best magazine. Buy. Speaking of which, and, and uh, it was it was right before we right before Lisa and I got married. So <laughs> we had we had saved all this money, and we had so I had like all the wedding money in my bank account oh, at right, the at yeah, the moment. Yeah. So um, I was at, we were walking through Best Buy, and I was walking with my wife's family. And my wife is white. For those of you who don't know me, so it was uh, it was fifteen white people and me. And I've got Lisa's elderly grandmother on my arm, and I'm making sure she's getting around the store right. And a cop is following us, and I just said so. I ha- I hand Lisa's grandmother off to Lisa's cousin Brandon. I say, hey, Brandon, come come walk with Grandma for a second. I I just want to go look at something, and I veer off from everyone else in the family, and the cop veers right you. off with me. Yep. Wow. <laughs> and, wow. He, and, he, and, he, and I and I was like, okay, maybe this is a coincidence. So I walked around for another about ten minutes, and he followed me up every aisle I went. Wow. And I was I told Lisa I was wow. like I halfway wanted to show. Do you him. want to see my bank account? Yeah, because I, I don't need to steal. I had, I had like thirty grand sitting in my checking account, like. 
yeah. it, because it was the we were getting married in like a month, so we were just about to start paying off all the vendors and probably stuff. Probably a good thing. You so did the money that. was he all probably there. Would have just said, "Oh, you definitely stole that." Yeah, yeah. yeah. What, 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 are you, what are you, a drug dealer? He yeah. probably would hit me with that yeah, one. Yeah, he yeah. probably would have tried to have seized that Thank somehow that. virtually. Yeah. 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 So and, you know, and, and you know that's coming. That's crazy. At some point that's coming. Yeah. Cops will be able to seize virtual money. It's coming. Oh, yeah. yeah. Easy, and, easy. and so I'm sure somebody's going to listen to this and go, it's already happened. Yeah, yeah. it's already happened. Mm-hmm. So at that point, the cop would have probably been like, oh, if we're, you're not oh, doing we're gonna, anything we're, wrong, we're, we're, you won't get arrested. We're going to seize your money, you know? Yes. You know what else is happening? And, and we even, are, and even we now, are in a fucking tangent land <laughs> yeah, up exactly. in this yeah, motherfucker. And even, even now, it's like, yes, I I, I, I conceal carry a weapon every single day. And and I was in, obviously, I was still in Lurie. I was in Virginia. All I'm trying to say is pineapples on pizza. Pizza is bullshit. <laughs> yes, it is. It's disgusting. I, so sometimes I wonder if it's like, I guess I'm doing it because if somebody, you know, wants to get rid of me or my wife or my family or my loved ones, if right. I'm out with you guys, I would do my right. best to protect you guys. Right, right, right. First, I would do my best to get you guys us all the fuck out of there. Right, 100%. You know, before doing anything. But now I'm like, well, <laughs> how will it get twisted against me? If You know what I mean? Yeah. Is this, is this a, a point where I bring commentary. up that most of those who's... Sir forces are also burn crosses are the same that burn, burn crosses. crosses. There you go. All right, so so those burn crosses back are the on same track. Burn crosses. I, I saw a video. I saw a link on uh, one of my like, suggested stories or whatever was like nuisance bear who was relocated traveled one thousand miles to return to his that. park, and my response was fuck you, I won't do what you yeah, tell me. I saw that. Yeah, I think I liked it because that was an excellent that was an excellent social yeah. media post. So anyway, let's 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 back bring it back. Around, I've there is before, no segue before for we this, do that. But, all right, I just want to really quickly check the poll. Uh, uh. 83% <laughs> say onions uh, smell worse currently at the moment. Look again, you're asking the wrong no, question. We're asking we're the asking right the question. Exact this right is question. exactly what we talked no, the, about. The we was, we would you rather, we are shaming recording. you into proper behavior. <laughs> If a beautiful woman Look at this reply <laughs> <laughs> What is it? Uh, it's, great. it's a guy Go, go to the RG Twitter page yeah, right, it's, right. a, it's just a reaction of a guy right, right. like, Seriously though like, bro, What are you talking about? Seriously though Cut that, cut that, cut that, cut that, cut that. Nope, <laughs> nope, 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 sorry You're nope, telling nope, me right nope. now Your dream girl Scarlett Johansson Anna Kendrick Whatever dream girl you have she pres- oh, can you name? Can you name them? Name 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 the, the celebrity. For you, you're allowed to have a list. Your list. Yes. You know the list, right? Yeah. Just Who's top one. of your list? Anna Kendrick, always. Okay. Yeah. yeah. Ryan. <laughs> Actually, that's that's pretty out of my list. I too. listen. I think Anna Kendrick is awesome. She's wonderfully quirky. And she's incredibly <laughs> open with her sexuality. Yeah, and she's Who wonderfully is this guy? quirky. Who is this guy? She's very very beautiful, very good looking. Mm-hmm. So she's she's one that it, it's not just about looks either. Correct. She's top tier as far yep. as looks, but also personality wise, yeah, that's yeah. what you want. Yeah, yeah, you know. Yeah. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> yeah Ryan. Hang on. <laughs> so there's an ad on the bottom of our. Our, oh God. Uh, of our poll. Under our poll says a little. It's the Virginia DMV promoted tweet. A little eye contact can go a long way toward reducing pedestrian injuries. Oh my God. Jesus. That's it's an ass eating question, not fucking DMV. <laughs> <laughs> that timing was just terrible. Thank you, Steph. Sorry, Steph. Shout, shout out to Stephanie here, who's been putting up with us today. All right. Yeah, that question. She so, looked at us like, what yeah. the fuck Did are y'all talking it? about? Oh, no. Oh, yeah, she oh, heard no. It. I'm sorry, Steph. No, I said it's an ass-eating question, yeah, not a DMV question. And she was like, what? <laughs> All right, so moving right along. Is that be real, Tom? Yeah, it's time to be real. Oh, shit. Because people like post Oh, no, my B-rolls. phone. <laughs> What's going on? Oh, your phone's taking my the video. Phone, my phone's taking oh, video right now, so it is what it is. All right, so... Let us uh, let us recenter ourselves here. Yeah. Um, back to the game. Back, back to, to well, the I wanna, So I want to kind of pivot a little crib. bit. Show you how we back live. Back to the game. So back, back to, to reality. Oh, back, back to, to reality. way of life. Whoa. Soul to soul. Yes. Back to life. Back, back to reality. Whoa. Oh. <laughs> I'm glad you know Joey's that like, shit. wait a minute. We, these people have earned some black points. Yeah, no, no. Well, and Will has earned some, like, old guy points because I'm about yeah. seven or eight years older than yeah, Will. That's true. And so it was right. And that song came out when I was, like, five or six. So I'm, that's, that's, hey, cult, cult, culture points I'm right there, with my Mark, guy. Mark. Because Mark is rocking with us. Mark is, is, is we're <laughs> Africans, Americans, and Mark. Plus Mark. <laughs> you motherfuckers don't know shit. Yeah. I was in a club. That's Will. Here's the thing. Every time I've secretly tested Will on African American shit, he's 100 percent co-signed it the correct way. He don't even know. That's why. That's why Will is my guy. I Because he don't co-signs know. it right every fucking Will, time. Will, do you use body wash or a hot rag? 
uh, loofah. <laughs> yes, me too. I use a loofah as well. All right, so this is another skincare section of the Arsenal podcast here. All right, yeah, shout, shout out Doctor Squatch as well. Oh, I, I've heard I've heard good things. Yeah. All right, so let's let's talk about the World Cup a little bit, and not so much about like the outcome or whatever, but like our guys. Murders. Thank you. Okay. Yep. That was Joey. Uh, I, I feel like, <laughs> honestly, for us. Uh, Joey, Joey Chapman is not wrong. No. He's yeah. not wrong. Correct. But where I, the angle I'm coming from is, like, I feel like as a team, we've had about the best guys on international duty window. Like, and Jesus being gone for a few months is bad. But you look at Partey's history of injury. He didn't pick one up. Yep. Jaka didn't pick one up. Saka yep. didn't pick maybe, anything up. Maybe if Jesus would have started for Brazil instead of fucking Dick Charlison, hey, maybe well, they would have gone yeah. farther. I mean, Richarlison did play great. Richard, but, Richard, well, he, he played great in, like, one game and maybe had the goal of the tournament. He did have a goal but, of the tournament. Yeah, very early. But, and the yeah. thing about Richarlison is he is so streaky. I'll admit he's, I mean, a, he's even, a good player, but man, and even, so even, play well, even in their even in their quarterfinal game, he he played pretty well. But no, my, my point it, being, it was, like, it was their I defense guess. just really fucked. No, up. like the, the well, whole, they, they started Tiago Silva. He's nine hundred and seventy-two years old. I know. Oh. Meanwhile, meanwhile, they couldn't find a spot for Big Gabby. Yeah. They, instead, they took Brimmer, who was yeah. so at yeah. the time Big Gabby ha, was part of the best defense in the Premier League, and Brimmer was part of the team who was seventh in Serie A in Juventus at the time. Yeah. Thank you, Steph. But no, my, my point being like Saliba barely played. Ben White, obviously, for whatever reasons, didn't play. You know, like you, the only guys who got some real miles on him, honestly, were Xhaka and Partey, and that was all in the group stage. And Saka right. and Saka. Well, Saka to a certain degree, yeah. I mean, Saka but, played every game. Yeah. But, again, like, it didn't go, like, all the way deep. Yeah, I mean, I hear you. So, you know, like, I feel like we came out of that as best as we could possibly have expected yeah. to as as Arsenal, you know? Also, who who the fuck is better than Tomiyasu as a right back for Japan? Like, what? Yeah, I, well, I think because he, he was coming off an injury with us. I think that's what was going that, on. That, yeah, it was his fitness level. I s- yeah. I but the, still, he came back. He actually came in. I think played left back for them. Every when time, he, when he, every when time, he went in. one time he came in as center, as a CB. But he could play all the way across. I know, the back. I, mean, I know. He can, yeah. And here's what I'm saying though: is like Japan's defense was s- legitimately more solid. God damn. Once he was in the, the game. Fucking camera catches me doing basic Seven. arithmetic. Sorry if you heard that. Fifteen <laughs> plus fourteen. <laughs> I'm just apologizing to Steph for the explicit nature of our comments yeah. today. Yeah. Thank you, Steph. I'm, I'm apologizing for my math abilities. I'm like, Ryan, what does this say? Two plus Eleven two is four plus minus 17. one. That's three. Mm. Quick math. Quick maths. Your dad is forty-four. <laughs> but, that girl was a uckus. But yeah, I mean, like you, you see your ducking. girl in the park. You no, know no, we're ducking. ducking. <laughs> oh, tang, nang, nang. <laughs> Jesus Christ. All right. So, no, but like, you, look, you look at, I mean, even I have the, a new sound for you, by the way. I'll oh, let you listen to it after. after like a reg- you look at a regular international break and you wonder, Jesus, what's going to happen, you know? And yeah. you look at six, potential six weeks of it and you go, oh, Jesus, you know? Yeah. And I mean, as it turns City, out, Jesus, Jesus was, was the problem. Podcast, yeah. but City's players, City's players got a lot of miles. Yeah. City's players got yeah. a lot of miles. They they put about they they had about the same amount maybe a little bit more than we did to the World Cup and most of their players got a yeah, lot. I think of miles. they had the most in the yeah, yeah. The I think they were at, yeah I think they were like, like one 14. dude or something yeah. like that. But oh, they, it's it's clearly me tweeting about this on this poll. Oh yeah, <laughs> and tweeting to the replies. But they got a lot of miles. Yeah, and so like we came out of it relatively fresh, uninjured except for one person, and you know like would it be better if Jesus was still healthy? Of course. But, like, I kind of, you, you feel, like, the way that people play soccer, now I guess it changes internationally because it's not the same as the Premier League when they just choose to beat him up because you've got more, like, England is a different team. Yeah. But, like, you worry about him. You worry about, like I said, Partey, who's injury prone. Right. And critical to us. Like, I think we came out of it pretty darn well. I right? agree. I agree. And, you know, so, and the question, of course, is, like, how are you going to restart? Like, how is the intensity going to be coming back? And, <clears throat> you know, it took us a minute to get, like, I, I don't think our problem today was – that you know the restart was weird and any of that sort of thing. I think it was. It took us a minute to adapt to the way West Ham was playing. And once we did, we obviously dominated. Yeah, yeah, I, I can agree to that. You sure. know, so like, I, as far as the World Cup break goes, it could have gone a lot worse. I think is kind of where I'm going for with sure. this for us. Yeah, I mean, <laughs> Wait, and was, no, no, uh, Jesus was the only player that got yeah. hurt. Now, yeah. now, now he's 
He's hurt, hurt. He's and, and he'll he, be back and, in and as far as importance to our team, boy, he's is up he there. up there? He's up there. Boy, but, is he up there? But legitimately, he's he's already been rehabbing really well. They're yeah. very prom. Like before they're very, I even knew it, he'd already had the surgery. Yeah, like, yeah. Like, oh yeah, they, he had, he had like, the surgery quick, quick, quick. that Monday. Yeah, yeah. They like they basically told Brazil right because hey, he, send him back. Well, we yeah, got him because because yeah. they were like no 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 no. You, you, we're flying them back now. Yeah, and and so they flew. Them I back. like I like this this I like that stance. Like yeah, s- send it to us to our team doctors. Yeah. We will coordinate. Yeah. We'll get it done. Yeah, yeah. He's he's our player. Yeah. He just happens to be Brazilian and yeah. play for your national team. Yeah, but he's our player. Well, um, that leads to my next point. Is you know Eddie obviously acquitted himself very well today. Yeah, but Eddie oh, can't. Oh boy. Yeah, can, but can some some two people touches, two some touches. people are gonna need to shut the fuck up. <laughs> Uh, now, to Will's point, Will saying two touches, holding up the number two, because he's, we, as we call him, Will Stradamus here. Um, when Eddie dilly dallies on the ball and takes more than three touches or more than two touches, yeah, you more. know, he gets just possessed. A lot of times he doesn't score. If he if he takes less than three touches, one touch turn bang, it, it's pretty much in the goal every time. Yeah, yeah, yeah. that is his game. It's yep. the strongest point of his game. And, and that's the thing is like for his goal. He received the ball first touch first in the touch, box already. The, the second touch it's, was the shot. That's yeah. that's why I'm yeah. saying like if he gets the ball outside the box, I like I'm just like yeah, I don't think anything's gonna come out of this. But inside like, the box, he's fucking lethal. Right. If he's inside the box and his first touch is yeah. inside the box, I'm like we got a shot. And, and, and the, a the the sharpness he has inside the box this year. I've been saying it yeah. since uh, since a bunch of us went up to Baltimore. I've been saying, listen, he looks just a little bit different, a, like a, a level stronger. above in his strength and pace. Yep. So when he gets the ball in his area, yep. in his area, like he can he can shove off yeah. anybody. Well, that's the thing. I mean, and and, you know I mean? and this is what I loved yesterday. Arteta, you know, talked about Eddie and just about how he's been very pleased and happy with how Eddie's been. Absolutely. This season, even you know, even though he hasn't scored a lot of goals for us when he when he has had the chance to play. But it, even if he training, didn't score today, he led the line right. well. He's and then he got his goal, very, so. Yeah, he's training very it's well. He's got the right attitude. He's spending the time in the film reviews and everything like that. And so Arteta's very pleased with him. Because well, he said, like, he came out and said, like, we re-signed him for a reason. Like, he's, yeah. he's a very important player to us. Yeah. You know? Yeah. But my question is, with Jesus out and Eddie being our number one striker, who do we have to spell him? Like, he can't start every game going in the, in the next we're, run. We're buying. We're buying. Like, are we buying? Or yeah. are we I, can't, I, I, I can't guarantee it. But, but see, they, Will, I, Will and I are seen, both gambling men, and I would bet I would bet a lot of money on it. Fabrizio, I don't know if it was Fabrizio or, or Will. Will or won team, like four hundred bucks today, by the way. Yeah, Shout true. out to Will. So one, one of them said that the number nine gonna, is not a target. I'm humble brag. Five hundred. Five hundred. Well, there you go. But no, like, I've heard that number, number nine fire. is not a target for this us. This podcast so. brought to you by Will Adams. Yes. Number, number nine is not a target for us. Our target is our target is big. Sh- Big, strong wingers with pace. Yeah. So basically, I think every every attacker that we're looking at can moonlight as a number nine. Okay, so that, that's the idea. Also, every attacker that we're looking at could take could potentially take Martinelli's spot while Martinelli moonlights as a number Which nine. Which I don't yes. want to. Like, he's not. I don't want to see. He, him do he, that. He's not it. He hasn't been it as a number nine thus far. Uh, I'm willing to give him one. Great. I'm willing to give him another shot based on his, and honestly, based on his physical progression. Yep. Yep. Like, I mean, just his, his arms and legs. All, he's been hitting the yeah, weight room. He's all been, season. Yeah. He's been fearless. What about this Danilo guy? Isn't he supposed to be a box to box or defensive midfielder? Oh, if we're going to go after it's, a defensive midfielder, there's only one player that I want to get, and it's the one we face today. And that's Declan Rice. Oh, Declan Rice. Yeah, you mean Mister Chelsea? He's not going yeah. go to Chelsea. Yeah, no, he, he embodies. No, he's he's, 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 yeah, yeah. he's Chelsea. Chel- he is going to Chelsea or United. You heard it here first. He's white. He's he not looks coming like to United. United. He's, he's not coming to Arsenal. <laughs> he he's going like to Chelsea or like United. There's Honestly, I would say I would. You don't think he's going to Arsenal? No, I just don't think he is. The archetypal Arsenal. I want Joey on this one. I, I and like, he is the archetypal what Chelsea or United would. I would admire go. how he I'd plays. I'd say United for sure. Chelsea, he's, he's an excellent uh, player. Chelsea, I, uh, listen, Chelsea is is the highest money. I if know. I were giving you odds on this, for me, Chelsea would be the <laughs> highest right, money. Fair enough. Also, hey. West Ham to Chelsea is a popular move. Frank Lampard, which is which is like the old Southampton yeah. Yeah. talented young player. Which is insane yeah. to me. South they're fucking Liverpool. they're fucking London rivals, man. Like, why are you fucking? Oh, but Chelsea that. have two Champions Leagues. They, they're the they're the the close by club that has has been wildly successful yeah, in recent fair. years. That's I want to say Lampard, Joe Cole. Is jo- does Joe Cole have a connection? Yeah, Joe yep. Cole does, was he was a West Ham. Yep. How West many West years does Rice have left on his contract? Is this his last year? 
Um, I don't know. Or does he have one no, more? No, I think he has one, one more after this yeah. year. So I think this summer is going to be the yeah, they're selling the we they're resign selling. him. I don't know that he's going to resign. I don't think he is. Because a lot of West Ham supporters would think he's a West Ham through and through. I think he wants to move. I no, think he Dick wants to move. under and contract through 2025. Oh, no shit. way. Yep. Did he just well, sign he must an extension? Signed, he must have signed one in 20. But, in 20 2021. I, I, I think happened, a five year in 2020. Yeah, that yeah, yeah. sounds like. To Joey's point, I love he signed a five year contract. A lot of Villa, a lot 2020, 2020, 2020, a lot of Villa yeah. people thought Drag Grealish was going to be. And that's, that's exactly who I was going to say. Grealish was labeled as. Oh, he's a Villa, Villa, man. Villa through and through. Villa Absolutely. Through and and, and that nowhere. never happened, yeah. Then and Manchester United threw the fucking bag. Or Manchester City, United threw the fucking yeah. bag at him. Yeah. And they and, don't even fucking play. And historically, there were a lot of players where you can see that. Say, for instance, I'm trying to. I can't remember the player, but. Vieira, for instance, Vieira had two offers from Inter. Yeah. No, he had no, not Inter. It was uh, Real Madrid. Real Madrid, yeah. yeah, yeah. And I think now with Grealish, I think Grealish was really the guy that, for him to go to City, that is the baseline now that a lot of players that are, and I hate to say this, I really hate to say this, but somebody like Bukayo Saka, yeah. If we don't do what we need to do, he's gonna go to City. Or yeah, could you imagine? Uh, well, 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 we can't imagine because they're we, on England. But if we win the, 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 the league this year, the thought. If we win the league this year, it's a guarantee that he stays. Oh yeah, because I, I, no, no, I feel no. that if he already get, believes get, in the project. If we get top four, he yeah. stays. I feel I mean, that he already believes in the project. Fact. But yeah. we still got, we still got, you still got to get the deal we're, done. We're virtually yeah. guaranteed top four. Yeah, no team that's been top at Christmas has ever finished out. Ever finished out. You got to remember this, right? Like his his best friend is ESR. ESR signed his extension last year. Martinelli just Martinelli signed his, signed his like quite, in the last well, week. Not yeah, yet. Or, it's not well, official yet. Yeah, not yeah, official but, yet, but, yeah, but yeah. it will be. Just give him the pen. Yeah. Just give him the pen. He's I remember Bukayo said, said he's come out in public saying, "Hey, yeah, all they got to do is put Martin, the paper Martin, for me and give me." Martinelli, a pen. since the day he came to the club, said, "I'm playing here the rest of my life." Yeah, yeah. but Buc- and so, Bukayo, sorry, I love that kid. About three years ago, Bukayo, as do when, I. the last contract he signed, the most recent contract he signed, his exact words were, "I'm from London. Arsenal's my club." Yeah. And yeah. those were stuck with me. I thought they should absolutely they should turn this into a shirt. It yeah. should be everything. Saka's not going anywhere, man. But also, he, he's probably on like fifty k a week right now. He's about to quadruple his money. Oh yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. at least minimum. Yeah. He'll no, be, he's at on, least quadruple. Uh, he's on. Well, I don't know what the weekly is. He's like one point five a year apparently. So yeah, that it probably 52. is about fifty. Yeah, divide yeah. that by fifty two. Yeah, I'm, not, I'm not doing that. But um, Joey, Joey got it. Yeah. So my question is like, do we do Just we say one point five mil divided by fifty two? Can like can we slash do we recall Balogun? That's the question. No, no. Leave him in France. He's doing phenomenal. Let him, Let do him thing. just like just like we do with Saliba. Yeah. Give him the full season as yeah. a starter. Is because Fal- is Falagan going to fire us into the fucking Falagan. title? Yes, Falagan. I'm going with it. He's on. He's Falagan. on like 30k. He's on 30k. A week, Jesus yeah. Christ. Yeah, he needs a raise. Yeah, yeah, yeah. He'll get paid 250. He's gonna. He's gonna 30k. He'll get paid 250. Yeah, he is going to 6x his money. Yeah. He's going to what is that? Sex tuple yeah. his money. Yeah. He's gonna ass eat tuple his money. Yeah. <laughs> but no, like he. He deserved, and he deserves right, every penny. There is no we're gonna convert you yet, but, but here's my thing: is he, des- he deserves every fucking penny. Oh, well, sure. you know, and I, and I'll never because we talked about this in the past. Slide too. a blank check over to him, let him fill yeah. in the amount. We we talked about this too, even on the podcast. I'm pretty sure. Sorry, I didn't mean to touch your computer there. Um, yeah, Don't yeah, touch yeah. my shirt. Yeah. Yeah. But the um, what how if, how there's what been, if, there's there to eat your ass. There have been what if she were to say there have been comparisons, right? Where people were Ryan, trying I would like to get in that leather Fuck wallet. Your life. Oh my Bing God. Bang. <laughs> so it hasn't been happening Joe this Byron. year. It hasn't been happening this year, but Take last year dinner, baby. last year there were a lot of people talking about comparisons between a Wobi and Saka. No. And, and nah, he, but no. here's what? exactly. But listen, here's what they were comparing. And Wobi's been playing well this year for yeah, Everton. Yeah, but yeah, yeah, but, yeah, yeah. but, but they're not the but, same. But what they were comparing was when you looked at a Wobi's numbers, because Saka Saka had going into last year had relatively the same amount of games appearances yeah. for 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 Arsenal. And when you looked at his numbers compared to a Wobi, his goals were actually a couple less, and fewer. His, <laughs> fewer, <Wow>. fewer, <laughs> fewer. <laughs> hey, what's fewer in German? Fuck your life. Fewer? Vaniger. No, that's not it. That's not it. <laughs> what is it, Tom? 
Vinegar. Vinegar. Okay. There you go. No, right. Vinegar. I made, I made a joke uh, in WBH bad taste. He said, what's fewer in German? I said, fewer. Yeah. I heard And then someone's going to obviously fucking dissect Vinegar. Like, what was the second half of that fucking word? Oh, fuck's fuck sake. No. <laughs> Come on. No. no. But anyway, so the. Uh, no, I'll personally talk to them. But legitimately, there the were people saying that Sokka is no better than a Wobi. And I, when I heard that last year, I swear to God, I thought I was actually going to like pop into my screen, go through the interwebs, <laughs> pop out the other person's screen, Punch and him in the smack dick. him but in here's the face. Like, Iwobi it it wishes he had a progression, that the same progression that Sokka had from 2020 to 2021. Yeah. Iwobi played like 120 games for us and scored, what, 14? Iwobi's thing was Sokka, he was Sokka, Sokka literally became twice as good over a summer. Iwobi's whole deal is he 100%. gets the ball, then he goes, what do I do next? Yeah, yeah. 100%. Like, he has, he does not have the forethought or the pace of play to, like, yeah. be thinking ahead. Yeah. Now. Sokka well, is One is player, man, he gets the ball, and he's like, okay, here's what I want to do. I know exactly what He knows what he wants to do it. before he gets the yeah. ball. Yeah. Look, keep named one of these players to their all-FIFA World Cup 2022 tournament all eleven. And one yeah. of them was not there. Yeah. So, so and, 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 I, and I like this one because there are some people that escaped earlier that were trying to tell me two weeks ago that Harry Kane is better and Jude, Jude Bellingham is better. And, you know, it's all about the clubs that are pursuing them and X, Y, Z. I had two Englishmen in my team at the tournament, but neither one of those guys were in there. Precisely so. I mean, and Jude like Bellingham oh, is I, going I, to be If very, you very have good. to choose an English player right now... To form it's Bakayo Saka. I don't need to hear the end of that sentence. And it's then, Bakayo Saka. Yeah. And then second place Sorry. for me is Phil Foden. Yeah. Second place for me is Phil Foden. Yeah. That's fair. Um, but he was not so good at the World if, Cup. Or if you guys was, he good. Well, because he didn't get as much playing time. Yeah. And I'm not saying when, he once shit. he got once he became the starter for England in the last two games, he was much better. Yeah. When he was coming off the bench, he wasn't doing well. Can I, if you guys would indulge me. goal today? Did they play today? What? No, 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 no. They didn't play today. No, they played, they they played Wednesday. Wednesday. Yeah. If you guys would indulge me, can I go over my uh, World Cup team of the tournament real yeah, quick? Yeah, yeah, go All for right, it. Drop it. Uh, goalkeeper is Bono from Morocco. Um, there's a uh, spoiler alert. There's a lot of Moroccan guys in this team. Okay. Uh, right back is Hakimi, uh, Ashraf Hakimi yeah, from Morocco. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah. Center back is Josko Gvardiol from Croatia. Sure. Yep. Uh, Josko P. Coltrane. <laughs> Josko P. Coltrane. Give me Harry Maguire. C- center back is Harry Maguire. Yep. He was good. Uh, he was good. And I hate Harry Maguire. Yeah. And for, but for, for England, England, for yeah, England for, he's for always England. good. He's great there. He's going to be awful. He's with great. The next yeah, yeah. United. It's going to be great. Uh, for at left back, I've got Acuna from Argentina. Yes. Oh, he had an amazing. Oh. God, tournament. yeah, he was phenomenal. <laughs> uh, at, at, in midfield, and Sorry, I, guys. I hear, <laughs> I hear rumors that Liverpool's after this guy, and I want him to like Arsenal so bad. Sofian Amrabat uh, uh, of Morocco, okay, uh, in midfield, uh, in midfield, Alexis McAllister of Brighton and Hove Albion. For yep. Sure, yep. What a tournament Argen- he's Argentina. had. The Argentina. least Argentinian gonna, name of anyone yeah, ever to live gonna, in Argentina. Well, Alex, Alexis but is what a, a Hispanic but name. What a but, fucking family. His dad and himself have now won a World Cup. His dad and yeah, himself, and they they were friends with the Maradonas and and Messi, yeah. friends with the Messi's. Yep. Like what um, a fucking lineage yeah. you got there. <laughs> yeah, he, that's footballing pedigree as yeah. as yeah. as, uh, as Jose Mourinho would say, heritage. This is heritage. <laughs> um, uh, at, at, in my tin hole, I've got Antoine Griezmann. I think he was the highest sister at this World Cup. Yeah. Uh, and yeah. in my forward line, I think. Everyone had this as a forward line, Mbappe, Messi, and Saka. Yes, 100%. I feel like Julian Alvarez deserves a shout. Or, or even Giroud. Both of those guys are in my yeah. honorable mentions. But, I mean, yeah. For, for I mean, me, but Alva- Mbappe like, is going to be your starting like If we're going to talk World case, Cup, for so. me, Alvarez is what made the, he, he's who like one of the big difference makers for Argentina sure. because <laughs> not pre- named Messi. Well, but in previous years not it was Messi, it was yes. Messi and Prey. Yeah. It was everything's on Messi, go Messi, go yeah. win the game for us. And Alvarez unlocked a lot of things and yep. relieved some of the pressure and yep. allowed Messi to do what he did. Listen, yep. you, you know who is a secret weapon in any final he's ever played in? Di Maria. On Hell Di, Di Maria. Maria. Sure, sure. Di this motherfucker Maria. is and they the definition of the final. Though. Exactly, yeah. but that was but, intentional. But he's they, the they definition of a big game player. This, it, when, if, if you looked up big game player in the yep. dictionary, yep. it'd be a picture on Hell Di Maria. I feel like every fucking look, time, and that, he's when they, the difference. So, Not a difference, he's the difference. But here's my thing, is that my line before the World Cup was Argentina always falters before they should. Sure. Yeah. 
and the reason for like the reason that I think it keeps happening is because they've been leaning They're on Messi, Messi and so and hard. Oh, yeah. Yeah. Right. right. And but so this like year, but Al- this year was different because of the fact that the whole team collectively said, "No, we're right. doing this for him." But also, and, and Alvarez and was a huge part of that. The yeah. co- yeah. for me, the coaching yeah. more so than Alvarez. Yeah, because yeah. he played. Because with Messi. I could, I could highlight Alexis McAllister as the thing that they didn't have in previous tournaments yeah. that they had in this tournament. Also, shout out to Rodrigo DePaul, yep. who also kind of filled that role. Yeah. Um, their their uh, Luis Scaloni, their coach, uh, Didier Deschamps was was found out. In the yeah. first half of that final, oh yeah, yeah. he was completely outclassed and outcoached uh, look, on a tactical level. He was he by, was, by Scaloni. Uh, I'm, I'm I, like, I don't care what anyone says. You know, after after we send out this recording, he was found out the entire game. Yeah, the, the he France, was. France only was the, in that by game the time because he figured of one it out. man. Yeah, yeah, because Mbappe, of one man. Yeah. Yeah. France in that entire game, outside of Mbappe, Facts. could not do Facts. jack shit. Facts. There's a reason why Griezmann was subbed off. Yeah, because Facts. he could not do jack yeah. shit. And, and Griez- was Griezmann the only one. Griezmann had broken out every single defense they yep. faced. He was yep. the linchpin of that yep. entire yep. attack, and he was utterly ineffective yep. against Argentina. Yep. And, <laughs> and Deschamps Bobby- got got uh, to me. If I was him, and I'm. I personally, as Joey, I'm virtually unembarrassable. I would have been fucking embarrassed if I was the Shop. Yeah, I would be afraid to show my face in Paris if I was the Shop. Yeah, I mean he's he got like, absolutely he's like, outclassed, tactically yep. beaten. He had, he's and, not on the he's not on the list with, of guys, with a better team. Yeah. He had a better yeah he did uh, uh, position a faster, for position. A faster team. Position for position, that France team is better. Yeah. But he, he's, he's not on the list of guys who should like who should be in one of the shipping containers from nine seven four back to their home country. <laughs> Bingo. Oh, Bingo. Yeah. Bingo. Like he's not Him, there with Tata. No. And He's oh, not no. there with um, oh, who's the other guy that we well, want to put in no, container. No, 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 no. I'm, I'm going to push back on you here. He is. He should be on in, in a nine seven four shipping I, container. I don't know because because he has consistently over the years been saved because of the player pool at his disposal. Yep. He's always been a fucking fraud, yeah. but he's always had excellent players. Yeah. Going back to the days of Ribéry, going back to the days of Henri and Vieira and Zidane. Christ, he, he's been there that long. No, he, has, he hasn't been there that long. I'm just <laughs> ranting at this point. But uh, at, at that <laughs> That's point, what I thought. at that point for uh, like to, and that was uh, I think that was Raymond Dominic who was there at that point who yeah. subbed but, off. Thierry Henry in that 2006 final. Facts, facts. Yeah. Like, what the fuck That's did you do? Facts. <laughs> um, but he, he, had the player pool at his disposal has saved him for like Three 11, cycles. 10 or 11 years now. Yeah, yeah. And he's going to get found out. And if, and listen, if, if he is the, is the France manager at the beginning of World Cup 2026, I'm North shocked. America. I don't think he will be. I yeah. would be shocked. I, they have. I to, would be shocked. So appalled, yeah. bamboozled, run amok. He Let can't play. Let us stray. He, he man, got small I, hands. He man, can't hold the ball. Uh, he's, well, not a, he's not on my sound pad. He can't play the game. He can't play the game. He got no footwork. He doesn't have to turn the move in the post. So his thing is Euro Euro twenty twenty. Now Raymond Dominic is going to be a lot of fun. Euro Euro twenty twenty four is going to be a lot of fun because both. Facts for both France and England. Both of their managers are. If you don't win, you're out. You're done. Yeah, you're out. So, but but I, could, I, I, I just I'm, swear, I'm I, discouraged by how I fast swear England, that the FA said that no. Gareth was staying. The oh. Deschamps is gone. Already? I couldn't believe I, it. I mean, I don't know. I, look, the decisions. What? Wait, what did you just say? I just swear I heard that he was already out. Wait, I don't wait, wait, so. wait, 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 look that up. Look that up because I'm going to say this about Southgate. How the fuck does this man still have a job? Right. His decision making. Facts. His and choices. Ben White to leave. His his choices. The Champ is not. Play. He has not, been, not, sacked. He's okay. not been sacked. There, his choices on who to put in the games. No trash. Like he doesn't sub in Grealish against France until literally the eighth minute the into funny stoppage thing, also, time. Also, he took Saka out against France. Oh god. Yeah. Right. And he was the best player by a country yeah. mile yeah. all yeah. fucking day. The funny now, thing about yeah. an Arsenal supporter, great. He's yeah. not gonna get hurt. Yeah. He's gonna come Rest him. Yeah. But if I was an England supporter, so my my so I was in Luray this weekend. Uh, Lisa's cousin Dawson. And he left in Harry His Kane wife, his wife is from Manchester. Tournament. Right. Yeah. Uh, Lisa's cousin Dawson, his wife is from Manchester. Her name's Emma. Shout out Emma. She's from Manchester, and we had a long talk over Christmas dinner about, and I was like, how do you feel about Southgate? And she basically said, in no uncertain terms, fuck Southgate. No, the no, funny thing about Southgate no English is fan that, I like, know of uh, likes Southgate. But you know who None does like Southgate? The players. The players. It's so and, weird. And, and the F.A. Well, the because, FA because he's he looks like a fucking but also schoolmaster. Yes, well, but also like he's, that he's gotten him farther than I want to say. Just like David Lee Ross said, those other guys. David Lee Ross said, you know the reason people like. Elvis Costello is because the people that like Elvis Costello look like Elvis Costello. Yeah. Facts. Facts. So it's the people yeah. that Facts. like 
Gareth Southgate look looked like, like Gareth Southgate. Yeah. He looks like and some go to sort parties of... that Gareth Southgate would be at. <laughs> right. Yeah. And I think and I I think he's a good I think he's a good man manager. I think he he's had the sad. right reactions to like when Saka yeah. and Rashford and Sancho suffered race. I think he had the absolutely the right reactions Agreed. to that Agreed. to that type Agreed. of shit. And and no, he's I feel good like with it's the guys, always, but he's terrible with the tactics. Yeah, it's always he's former terrible. players that are good with that because yeah. they they played with yeah. they played with people yeah. of color. Yeah. And so, so some of their closest they've, they've people experienced it with Yeah, some of their closest people they're like, "Hey, listen, I play with these guys that are yeah. fucking awesome. Yeah. Players and people. And yeah. so it, typically it's those ex-players that are this like man, that. This man those chose, white ex-players like yeah. ride hard for people of color. Yeah. Yeah. This man chose to sit Jude Bellingham on the fucking bench. Yeah. I mean, yeah. I, I, it's, like, it, it, yeah. it's, it's on. I don't understand. Did he play Hendo that game? I he guess? didn't play. Who did he play that game? James Madison played zero seconds. That's crazy for me. The I mean, entire he, he, was, he was injured coming, coming into the coming into it though, no, wasn't he? No, no, he was healthy. He's he, bro. What, he's what's, been, what's the expression? Rushers, best player. Sometimes, sometimes teams are play, set up to not lose the match. Yeah, yeah. And that it's like some people want to win the game. Some people want to not no, lose. It, yeah. England yeah. had the talent to, to, to challenge that France yeah. team. I thought so too. They had the talent. It just blew my mind. How does a country that has conquered? So many countries and, and just <laughs> when they get when they get these tournaments, yeah, yeah. put a plus this, in this charge man, of the football team. So uh, I, I, want, I, want to, I want to write back that when he gets to the halfway line, he recoils like a toddler in the ocean <laughs> when the fucking waves are rolling in, just like a corgi who's going to be out of yeah, overwhelmed by the side, water. <laughs> sideways passes lads, and then if there's a corner and fucking slab head can bang one in, I know. And then after that, He's like in two thousand this year. Yeah. Um. Uh, so p- for for. For a team that, or for a, a, a country that, I feel like every time they have an issue uh, out on an international stage, that issue is creativity and chance yes. creation. One, yeah. Yes. To not play Madison one second of that World Cup look, bizarre. Look, is yeah. fucking wild. To I me. mean, and here's the thing: it's is wild. When he me. would sub off Saka, he chose Sterling. Right over well, fucking it, Madison. It's, it's not. To, it's not that for me. It's choosing Mason fucking Mount, Mount. Oh over Foden and Madison. He and, and is a fraud. <laughs> he is a fraud. Yes. yes. Why does he 100%. get play time for Chelsea in England? <laughs> this fucking guy. No, I'm sure he's dude. a nice lad, yeah. but this guy dude. is a fucking fraud. 100 percent nailed it in the coffin, bro. Because what the fuck? He, he chose Mason Mount over Grealish. He chose Mason he, Mount Grealish, over right. Madison. Madison and Foden. And Foden. All three like, of them are better than him bro, at any position either Mason, of them would play. Mason it makes no is sense an absolute fraud. He's an absolute fraud. All, and he's been a fraud for Chelsea. All he, 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 he had one good year he, for Chelsea. He works he won, hard. He won them the Champions League. Yeah. And then they're like, oh, he's God's gift to earth. Bro, he, no, and he has not done no. shit. Since no. that Champions League, he he. Here's what Mason Mount does: he works hard, and there's something to be said for that. So but, does Christian Pulisic, but, but, and Pulisic yeah. creates more. Yeah. He doesn't see the and pitch. For me, and he doesn't see for me, shit. Mason Mount is the Danny Welbeck of the Chelsea midfield. Yeah, he works hard, yep. but yep. other players yep. produce Are better. for you. Yeah, because let me tell you something. God, please get Christian Phil, Pulisic Phil out of Chelsea. Yeah, no, no <laughs> I, I don't even care if he goes to United. I At think least he's Arsenal. Play. I think he goes to Spurs. What if he goes to Spurs? He won't go to Spurs. Uh, no. He's going to go to United or Newcastle. He was close to going to Spurs. United or Newcastle. Let me tell you something. That's, uh, my, that's my guess. Foden, Foden, Grealish, uh, and Madison are three times the technical player that Mount that made, is. Yo, 100%. Yeah. I, I just, that, that to me is perhaps the biggest indictment of Southgate. Yeah. Before the tournament, I would say, okay, I believe that Harry Maguire is going to play every game, and that's an indictment. Yeah. But Tom, Tom Harry, Maguire, Harry Maguire over here for some reason. was excellent. I believe he needs was a beer. Excellent. Yeah. Uh, I, like, in the World like, Cup. Yeah. So, uh, so at that yeah. point, yes. So, uh, but what I want Southgate is to give up is, oh, I evaluate club form. No, you don't. No, you don't. If you did, if Harry he did, Maguire, Maguire wouldn't have made no, the team. Yeah, 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 he he wouldn't be allowed anywhere on the plane. Just, Raheem just Sterling wouldn't have made the team. Yeah, Harry just Maguire say, can load the bags onto the plane and then say, fuck off. Well, if, I'll, if I'll push back club, on you on if, Sterling. That Chelsea team is okay. kind of abismal. He's ben been, White he's been a few bright spots. Ben White would have started. Yeah, he's been one of the few yeah, bright, yeah. bright spots. If he, but, if he went by club form, Ben White would have started. But don't don't say, don't say oh, I evaluate club form. Just say, hey, I got players that I fucking trust, and they're going to play. Pickford, yep. uh, Maguire, God, Mason that, Mount, because say. all three of those guys have two two plus guys on the team that are better than them. Jordan Pickford is Pickford fucking is the, garbage. He's Pickford, good. Pickford he's garbage. was the third best keeper on the England roster. G A R B I T C H. Garbage. garbage. All right, garbage. So, Terrible. Let's pivot for a second to a lighter topic. It's kind of World Cup related. 
Whose bullshit are you more tired of? Ebby Martinez or Salt Bay? Ebby Martinez. Salt Bay. Oh, Salt Bay. Salt Bay. Salt Bay. Salt Bay. Salt I would have said Ebby Martinez before anybody. Yeah. I'm still going to probably say Ebby Martinez. Salt Bay. Salt Bay. But I, I don't want to down. I said it with my whole chest I, last I'm, night. I'm going to say Ebby <laughs> Martinez, but I don't want to downplay how fucking tired of Salt Bay shit that I am. Like, yeah. the, how because long ago did Salt Bay become Salt Bay? It was like, it was like five, six years. He's been like. It, it's it's than that. Fucking yeah. video. It, was in, it was when I was in grad school, so that's 2017. It's a fantastic yeah, five metaphor. Years, maybe. It's a fantastic metaphor for. An Arab with a shitload of money that has no relevance but seeks relevance. That doesn't yes. season his fucking steak and puts gold <laughs> leaf on it and then gives but, you arm sweat. Yeah, no, so Will's gonna rant like I just ran. God damn it, I cup. hate him. His 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 steak doesn't even look good. But no, Tom made a good point. That was this World Cup. That was Shit this World like Cup. Yeah. 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 Like, listen, he, listen. He's the, probably very cautious on his social media, but Oh. Being, being Arab, did you, yeah, like did, his, listen, his wife notice. should be cleaning his yeah, asshole, yeah, 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 yeah. And, listen, and, and doing everything that he's. So told if, if you're not, if you're not whatever. part of the Argentina team, part of the Argentina staff, or closely, or family, or closely family related there. to yeah. this Argentina yep. team, get the fuck off. The you pitch. do not fucking touch the World Cup trophy. 100%. It is the most coveted trophy in, in the all world. of sports. In the world. You don't fucking touch Johnny it if you have no Fantino. business touching it. Yeah. And I, I'm and not funny. usually, I don't stand on tradition like this, yeah. but this is the one, you don't fucking touch yeah. that thing if you have no it's, reason to be yeah, touching it. It's just like the Messi's, Stanley Cup. Messi's wife and kids yeah. can touch it yep. because Messi can take the it Stanley, home for a week. The Stanley Cup yeah. for hockey is treated yeah. the exact same way. Yeah. And they should yeah. only yes. be allowed to touch yeah. it if, if you want it. Or two later. The, 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 if, if the, the Stanley Cup, if I saw the not Stanley within, Cup, I would within, sit and look yeah. at it and admire this. Like, okay, yeah. but I would thing. not touch it yeah. because I have not earned that right. Here's how crazy. Or I'm not the spouse of a person or the family of a person that has earned Because here's the crazy thing about the Stanley Cup. The handlers of the Stanley Cup. Phil. His name is Phil. He holds it with gloves on. Gloves yeah. on, yeah. With gloves on, yeah. Like even himself, he doesn't touch it. And I, I will say, and and uh, Wombold was talking to me about this, but the Stanley Cup is probably the most physically impressive. Oh yeah, trophy sure, in all of huge. sports. Yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. It's taller. I think it might be taller than me. No, it's, I'm it's five not. Foot, it's I'm like five foot six, five It's like four and a half feet tall. Like yeah. Four and a half feet, so it's taller than Lisa. No, it's not four and a half feet. It's not four and a half feet. She's it's, not here to hear it, so it's no fun. Um, but anyway, what were we talking about? Oh, Salt Bay. Salt Bay. Yeah. Because. Emmy, Emmy still annoys me more. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Because I mean, of the connection so with Arsenal. Well, and but, also, like, there's but, the, but the Salt whole... But Salt Bay can kiss my whole yeah. asshole, as yeah. Jay-Z says. Yeah. The, whole, it, the whole question about, like, the, the, the way the PKs and the gamesmanship what and whatever. What don't make me shit. <laughs> but, no, it's just, like, the whole, like, going up and handing the guy the ball and it being in his face and shit. Like, that's, just, that's not gamesmanship. That's being a little bitch. Yeah. You yeah. know? I mean, and it's, it's head like, games. And I, mean, also, I, I will admit, Ramsdale does head games, too. Ramsdale yeah. will literally stay in front of the guy and just be like, oh, I'm going to wait until the ref tells me I have well, to go to the line. And, and, and if anyone... Oh, is, and, and there might yeah. be some people out here that don't know it, but <laughs> when Emilia Martinez... or what, what, Emmy Martinez... Yeah. Uh, Clang, oh, bang. Oh, no, 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 no. Someone no. just ate shit? No. No, this is a chair. I think He's Stan, about I think, to. I think Stanley, Stanley's had enough to drink. Oh, yep. Oh, oh, yep. Stanley's down. No, you don't. No, you don't. Oh, it's man, time to go. Yeah. It's time it. to go. All right, he got it. So anyway, the there point is a breeze in this building that is affecting only him. <laughs> so all I, all I wanted to say was, <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Jesus Christ, go to Stanley's my fucking guy though. He's good people. Yeah, he, he is. is. He we've is. all we've all been there. Yep. I mean, I fell asleep in this establishment. So yeah, yeah. You go to Yes, <laughs> you did. Damn right. Yes, go. Yeah, say your point because I got a point I got to make about the World Cup too. That really pisses me Go off. Go ahead, Tom. Yeah, no, no, y'all are way more angry. Go for it. Go All right, so <laughs> I noticed Stop this. Stop time? Or not? No, no, okay. no, no. It's not that. It's it's just because the the play on the field was phenomenal. This was the best World Cup play-wise that I've ever seen. Best World Cup, best final, probably of my life. Oh, yeah. No, no, no. Yeah. Greatest. Well, you I, I, was like only one, I was only one year old uh, <laughs> when the like World Cup. I and I know, that, I know that that was a good World Cup. I was only yes. a year old yeah. for the 86 yeah, yeah. World Cup. I know that was good. Years. But for the World Cups that I've actively followed, so let's say since 94. Yeah, yeah. Um, and I was like nine in 94. Mm -hmm. So let's say since 94, this is considerably, by a considerable margin, the best World Cup. The most goals ever scored in the World Cup. Yeah. Despite Most, despite that, all the zero zero now now that record draws, draws, yeah, 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 in, that record in, in that record will get stage. beaten in the next World Cup because we're expanding well, to forty eight yeah. correct yeah. correct so so but my point that I'm making is this and I it's noticed like NFL this, records right now yeah it's I noticed game. I noticed the NFL or not God you said NFL now it's in my head <laughs> I noticed this during the group stage games 
and I noticed it during the elimination. And it even happened in the fucking final. All right. I'm gonna, and yes, I'm going to get heated here because it actually pissed me off. The Qatarian population. Qatari? That whatever. Yeah. That, that would come to the game. I'm not going to say that. Um, that would come to the game, right? And they were in the full dress robe, all that kind of stuff. They all left at halftime every single time, right. every yeah. single game. Yeah. And when we came out of halftime, even in the fucking final, yeah, the, have them the stands yeah. Yeah. were empty. And if right. you they notice, but here's the right. thing, if you shit. notice, as the, as the first 10 minutes of that second half went along, more and more people fart started to, to fill it in. But the point that my buddy Alan and I, um, that he made to me, was they weren't the same people because they weren't in the in the in the white dress robes, hmm. right? They were they were literally guarantee it. The uh, the hired fans or yeah, whatever. Cutter right. Cutter said, "Hey, you're not in the TV. Move over Get there." The TV. Yeah. They Move hire people. There. They hire okay. people. Yeah. Sit there. Be Plants. quiet. Yeah. Plants. Yeah. And notice. Plants, and notice. Yes. And notice. Occupy space. That in the second half specifically, they never panned around to the whole stadium right. to show the whole stadium right. because you would have seen empty seats on yeah. the other side. Instead, they always just kept the same camera angles where they were, right, and kept everything the same to make it look like the stands were still completely yeah. full. And like, I don't want to sit were. here and like they shame. Were. I don't want to shame people for not showing up. But at the same time, like this was supposed to be their coming out. Right. They deserve this. Whatever. I was and never going to go. Sh- I want to shame Cutter. I, I was I never going to go to Cutter. Them. Fuck I was, them. Yeah. Fuck I, was, I was never going to go to Cutter. I'm not going to shame people for not showing up to the stadium. Honestly, I respect people for not showing up to the stadium. Yeah, yeah. sure. I was never going to go to Cutter. I want to shame the country and their leadership. Right, right, dude. There were there were. Hundreds of thousands of people that would have killed to be at that game. Absolutely. Yeah. And they couldn't because the tickets were sold out. Yeah. To or people like, that, to or people like that left early. Thing to people that the, left at halftime. Yeah. And also in the semis, and that is like, there was bullshit. like, whatever, well, I don't know what the deal was, was about, but like, they're, they're, well, they're, yeah, because like Moroccan, yeah, yeah, like, yeah, chart, they, like yeah, Air, yeah, Royal they, Air Morocco had to cancel flights to Qatar because like all of a sudden like their tickets or their visas or whatever were canceled at the yeah. last minute. Every every and elimination all this weird game. Shit. Every elimination oh, game shit. was a sellout. I didn't hear that. Yeah, oh yeah, yeah. No, there, was, there was a whole bunch of Moroccan fans oh. that could not even get into the country because yeah. wow. their flights were yep. canceled at the last yep. minute. Hey, hey listen, listen well, 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 done. well done. I don't know. I can't remember the exact reason, but there was just there was there was just tomfoolery going on. Well, well done though to Morocco. I resent it. Oh yeah, it's, <laughs> the, it's the best <laughs> the best performance of an African team in the history of the World Cup. Yeah, phenomenal. They just say Ryan Belges all the time. They were great. They were great. And you would think. It would be like a Ghana, like Nigeria, also. Ivory Coast, yep. maybe the yep. sort of African powerhouses. No, Morocco, best performance from an African yep. team ever at a World Cup. Also, Sh- massive, massive fucking shout. And out they got a huge uh, boost in the FIFA rankings. How the fuck did America get to thirteenth? I don't know. Yeah, I don't get that. What the fuck? But, but let, let me, let me tell you something about Morocco. Win the world title and, and, be number and one. Germany's yeah. fourteen. I'm sorry if U.S. play Germany right now, we're getting yeah. fucking waxed. We're getting uh, waxed. I don't know about that actually. No, we get waxed. I'm just saying, why does why does Brazil stay number why one? Why does Brazil yeah. stay number one? Yeah, they just won Argentina won the World Cup. Yeah. They're yeah. the number one team in the Argentina world. Argentina should yes. be number one. Period. And they can't have been that far. What are they like five, well, six? More than anything that represents how bent the whole thing is. Yeah. 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 They just won the title. They're not number one. Imagine any sport in America. It's, it's because of the yeah. way the scoring works. Imagine the like way some, they do their scoring. I mean, unless it's like the Jacksonville Jaguars win the fucking Super Bowl by no, accident. They're the best team in the world. They're the best team in the exactly. NFL. Exactly. Yeah. Yep. Yeah. I don't give a shit if some guy. No. Motherfucker, they won that. They won the whole fucking. Thing. The victory goes to like, spoils. They, they, yeah. they, the get, victory goes they spoils. get the bragging right of saying we're number fucking one for the yeah. next while. This yeah. is where you're Dominance number one. Get champion. forty grit fucked well, in the and ass. Like, no and, filter. And, and, and you look at the you look at the party in Buenos Aires. Like you, you, you see that like they're not worried about the ranking number. They know they're number one. Like yeah. everyone there yeah, is yeah. fine. And with they're carrying around the trophy and having a seven million person parade in Argentina. So yeah, they'll be all right. Yeah, no one's heard about it. Can I tell you something? Can I tell you something about about Morocco? Though three players that I would love to have in Arsenal, I'm not gonna say I would kill to have them in Arsenal, mm-hmm. but I would definitely dismember a motherfucker to have them in Arsenal. <laughs> <laughs> Sofian Amrabat, okay, um, Ashraf Hakimi, he yeah. plays for PSG and he's yeah. one of the best right backs in the world, so yeah, he's probably won't come, yeah. but also Hakim Ziyech, Hakim Ziyech. Yeah. Yeah. yeah, Hakim Ziyech was he uh, was an honorable mention on my list of honorable mentions, kind of just missed out on making it, but and I know and Tom and I talk about this all the time, we don't want. We don't want Chelsea, Chelsea send-offs. Chelsea yeah. rejects. Yep. But, like, you know. It's He's not like, really a reject. We, we don't want Chelsea rejects, but if Mateo Kovacic all of a sudden came available, I want him. Yeah. Because yeah. he's quality, right? There's a difference yeah. between being late career Willie on and Hakeem Ziyech. Being, or or late know, career right. David Luiz, who is yeah. still better than Willie. No, David Luiz was, was actually pretty easy. He was okay decent for us. Yeah. Yeah. doesn't have much mileage. He's been in that he club. Yeah. He's been sitting on the fucking bench. Yeah, yeah same yeah. with Pulisic. 
Yeah, true. I, I let me tell. You, I would totally, totally take. Pulisic. I would take Pulisic in a heartbeat. I would totally take in a him. heartbeat. They, he is so underutilized oh, there, God. and obviously they believed in him at some point to give yep. him the ten shirt yep. after William left yep. to come to us and yep. fail. <laughs> yep. <laughs> Man, I fucking, every time I fucking they, hate Chelsea. I, was, I, was I fucking so, hate him so much. I was so scared for Will with his gambling today when Willian had that shot that almost went in. <laughs> and thank God Mitrovic got on the end yeah. of it oh, to salvage that What's shit. So like, the nothing the worse parlay. than also losing your parlay because of Willian. That would have oh, yeah. been. Yeah, that's, that's just an extra knife in the suck. fucking back, Willian. No, well, because yeah, that's the thing. Willian, you suck for our club and then you do this to me? Well, because I did. How dare you? You're going to do this to me? I did a straight You're gonna bet. You're going to be playing basketball in Pelican Bay when I get through with you. I did a straight bet on Mitrovic and Almiron to both Laundry score. room for you. And then I, and then I said, you know what? Fuck it. I'm also going to do a, a two-part parlay with both of them to score. Oh, and I'll just throw 15 or 10 on it. Uh-huh. And okay. All right. There you go. See All you happens. motherfuckers. Yeah. Jay. And it, y'all going to do this shit to me? Jay. I'm sorry. I'm, I'm training oh, day good. monologuing yeah, at this point. Good. So there you go. So we have, we have gone over up in this motherfucker, but we had a lot to say. Um, so, you know, it's a good restart. We're back, you know, kind of in, I mean, we look in form as informed as we've always looked. Brighton, Brighton, Brighton on up New Year's next Eve. on New Year's Eve. Come on out. It's 1230 Eastern start. Uh, come on out here. Start your New Year's party early and just keep it rolling. Be a legend as such. Uh, and uh, there's one more game after that. I want to say the third. So it's a busy, fit, busy section of the season. But, you know, we're going to keep it rolling. So until then. I'm Ryan, here with Tom. Top lead. And with Joey. Big Bong. And with Will. Yeah, gunners, yeah. And we'll catch you on New Year's Eve.